Hi, West Michigan. Tom Anderson here. Come down to Taste Muskegon. And I bumped into one of our former hosts that helped us out on DSE. And uh, this is Karen. And how are you doing, Karen? I'm wonderful, Tom. How are you? Oh, absolutely great. Now I'm standing next to you well, again. You just keep looking better and better. I don't know what it is you're doing, but... It must be you. <laughs> <laughs> and you have a couple of young people here that are special to you, are they not? I do. These are my niece and my nephew. Can you introduce yourself? And who are you? Aaliyah Mack. What's your name? Darnell Mack. Darnell Mack. Oh, isn't that neat? Yeah, they're down and, uh, here at the Taste with us, enjoying the beautiful sunshine with their parents. And uh, Very good. And we really miss you at, at the studio and working with you. Oh, I miss you, too. I might have to come back just to help out. I think so, because we used to have some great times together. Oh, I know. It great jokes <laughs> behind the camera, but we can't tell anybody. We can't tell anybody No, about no, that. no, no. <laughs> okay, West Michigan, we're going to be moving on and start checking out the Taste of Muskegon. What are you representing here? Uh, Old World Crippery. We just opened up two weeks ago. We're in the Century Club building. Excellent. So, and so you're getting your exposure today? Just a little bit. A little bit? You've got a line <laughs> out here all day long. What are you talking about a little bit? I had a line before I even opened today. And I'm not even going to stop you from working because you're <laughs> going to have hungry people and be mad at me if I'm not careful. That's right. And what are you offering today? Today we have, the popular item is a Nutella crepe for the sweet crepe line, or the crepe line. We also have a crab pollock in a artichoke dip. We have a cheeseburger, that's the all-American twist on the crepe. Excellent. And we have a garden crepe, that's uh, mixed vegetables. Okay, well listen, keep on working while you're done. You. I don't want you to upset <laughs> cheeseburger and a crab. A cheeseburger? A cheeseburger one and a crab one. Okay. There you go, look at that. It can't even wait for you to get done. Look at that, oh my goodness. Never saw that done before, that is the neatest thing. Now they do this in France, I think. Somewhere overseas? I think so, I, I read it on a, <laughs> read it on an airplane. <laughs> there you go. You decided to take advantage of it. That's right. It's amazing, a simple little tool, a couple of wooden sticks stuck together. There you go. Some people think it's a, just a thin pancake. <laughs> it looks like a thin it pancake. It does look like a thin pancake, doesn't it? Yes. Okay, well, listen, we're going to get out of your way because you've got a line up here, but really appreciate you stopping and talking to us. Where are you located again? What's the we're name? We're located at the Century Club building. It's on West Western Street. Okay, and the name of your business? Old World Crepery. And you're open every day so they can World, come up and enjoy Tuesday, it? Tuesday through Saturday from 10 till 2. Okay, thank you very much. We're going to move on and get out of your way. Well, thank you very thank much. Thank you. Okay, and now we're missing. We're checking out another booth, and you are. I'm Raj with Curry Kitchen, and you are. Uh, rec what do you have here? We have a chana masala. It's a garbanzo bean sauce. Where it comes with rice and a chicken curry. That's a really famous dish today. People with trying with the rice. Oh my goodness! It's almost gone. Uh, yep. The and hottest dish. Yeah, we sold about uh, about 12 uh, containers of them. Oh yes, my God! Last night, and those are samosas, and those are like. Filled with mashed potatoes and green peas in it. Okay. And that comes with a mint and a tamarind sauce on top of it. Okay. That gives you good flavor. You know? And if people want to find you elsewhere other than here, where, where are you located? We are uh, located on Third Street and uh, Monroe by me and by me, me and Grace. Okay. okay. And we've been open from last. Uh, this is our third month going on. Really great. Okay. So this is your time to let people know who you are and where you are and yep. what you have. Yep. All it's an ethnic Indian cuisine. Only one on the lake shore. Okay. Now you tell us. Who is this gentleman right here? This is my son, Raj Karan. That's your son? You know, you got to look over that way. Okay. Um, and this young lady over here? She's Amrit. She's my name's Amrit. And her dad is a chef, and she's also our ticket of the dining waitress. And oh, company. very good. Listen, yeah. you got people lined up, so we're going to get out of your way. But Sounds good. Keep up the good work. Let everybody know where you're at, and sell, sell, sell. Yeah. Right. Okay. Thank you. Thank okay. you. And here we are at Ruth Ann's Ice Cream, and who are you? I'm Aaron. And what are you doing really hard today? Taking tickets? I'm taking tickets. And, and you got sure your buddy over here doing all the work? Yes, I am. <laughs> That's great. Yeah. And who are you? I'm Matt. And Matt, what are we doing? Are we doing all the work? Thanks, Matt. Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> You're putting cream. your hands in the cold cooler there yeah, and pulling yeah, out nice. all these different... What kind of different ice creams do we have here? Well, we've got, you know, classic vanilla. We've got some Superman, mint chip, armoretto cherry, all sorts of good stuff. 
<laughs> and everybody's buying a little bit of everything? Yep, yep. And you're making sure they're staying cool today? Oh, yeah. Keep okay, well, cool. we're going to get out of your way so you continue because people right. want their ice cream on this nice, warm, sunny day. Thank you, gentlemen. Keep up the good work. I still think Ruth Ann looks better than you, even though I know that's not her name. <laughs> Ruth Ann's Ice Cream out on Scenic, Scenic Drive. Drive by Muskegon State Park. We're waiting right now as you make another batch as soon as you're done with this and get it on. Got to keep up with the customers, so we'll have just a couple minutes here and we'll be talking to them. I'm going to make you pasta. I 